<sighs> we so think we're free. You know, what I think about jury duty. First of all, luckily I never gone through it. And I pray that I never do. That I, you know, I pray I never have to go through it. But uh, I feel it should be a choice. If you want to go, go. If you don't want to go, you should have every right not to go. Shouldn't be forced. You know, this is why I say right here how we're not free. If we're truly free, then we should have the right to do what we want to do. We should have the freedom of choice. But it doesn't seem like that's the case. Because they're threatening that they'll arrest you if you don't go. Like, what do I have to do with a case when you think about it? Like, what do I have to do with this person? I got to choose if these people are innocent or guilty. What does this have to do with me? This has absolutely nothing to do with me. I'm just... Got to participate in some bullshit, whether I want to or don't want to. It just, you know, it makes no fucking sense. We should have the right to do what we want to do. I mean, how I look at it as it's like forcing somebody to drink. Like, think of it like this. The person doesn't want to get all screwed up and drunk. Come on, man, do it, do it. So it's like another example. But and if you don't participate in this, you get arrested. Now, I think you get paid a little bit for participating, but it shouldn't matter. It shouldn't matter. It shouldn't be forced. If someone wants to go, they should have the right to go. If they don't want to go, they should have the right not to go. Why are we going to get arrested? Because we got to just randomly be sucked in to a case to choose if this person's innocent or guilty. I don't give two fucking shits if he's innocent or guilty. It has nothing to do with me. Why should I care? You know what I mean? Like, that's the part that just makes no fucking sense. Bad enough, we got to get up every day out of our comf comfortable beds, waking up early just to be a stupid, mindless sheep for the system, trying to make ends meet. But now we get another headache on top of it. Now we got to be f pressured and forced into jury duty. If we get the letter or whatever comes in the mail, however that works. And if you don't go, you're going to jail, man. You got to go. Shit. Get your ass over here. You know, bad enough. We already uh, basically forced out of our will to get a job. Because if we don't, we're going to live in the streets. You know, homeless and bullshit shit. You know, that's not enough, though. You know, crazy. That's not enough. You know, we're not free in that way, and now they gotta fuck you over in another way. It's like saying you get an invitation to somebody's birthday party, and <laughs> you don't end up going, you go to jail. Or you're arrested because you didn't go to this birthday party. You know, that's how, I don't look at it as any, like, I look at it as the same thing as that. Like, that's how fucking pathetic. We should have every right to participate or, or do not participate if we don't want to. We should have every right to choose what we want to do, you know? I mean, that's how I look at it as. I don't know why we got to be forced to just randomly go and, you know, discover a case and we got to see who's out and give two shits. Yeah, he's guilty. He's innocent. Whatever. Get me the fuck out of there, you know? <laughs> and then, you know, it's just... And then who knows how the criminal looks at you or whatever... Probably wants to beat your ass. I mean, I don't think you ever get the chance. But then again, you never know. But that's besides the point. That's not even really the reason. It's just you should have no right to be forced out of your will to participate in something you really don't feel like doing. You know, we're already forced to be sheeps because we'll suffer the consequences if we don't be sheeps. You know, and now if we don't participate in this jury duty, we'll be suffering the consequences behind bars because we didn't go to some stupid case to choose who's innocent and guilty or we'll talk over it in this long desk. Guilty, guilty, innocent. Well, why do you say, you know, like, you gotta go through all that bullshit all day, sit in a fucking room where you feel like you're just blowing your brains out? You know? <laughs> I mean, it's just, it's, it's crazy. It's sickening. This world is so fucking sickening, man. 
I'm calling the police because he didn't come to my birthday party. That's how I literally look at it as. Because I didn't participate in some kind of justice law or whatever the hell. Should have no, I should have, I should have every right to not go if I don't want to go, you know? I mean, who the hell are them to tell me I gotta go? I don't know, man. It's just, this world, it's just, it's sickening. It really is. It's just literally mind blowing how crazy and how manipulated and corrupt this system really is. You know, it, re it really, really, it really is. Now, me personally, I would say I have an anxiety disorder. So I wonder if I got hound, if I can just say I have an anxiety disorder, which isn't a lie. It really is true, you know, but, uh, yeah, I mean, it's just, we should have every right to do what we want to do, you know. Who the fuck are they to tell us we got to go here, we got to go there? I can go wherever the hell I want to go. No, you can't. You must come and choose. And we need your decision if this guy's guilty or not guilty. And if you don't come along, you're guilty and we're going to put you behind bars, man. But, you know, we're free in this shit, man. We have true freedom. God bless America. Now, I'm going to be straight honest, America is a lot better than other countries, you know, but truth is, I'm talking worldwide wise, we're not free anywhere. We're not. And you know how they say we have freedom of speech? That doesn't always seem to be the case. You go on Facebook, you post some kind of stupid thing, they put you in some kind of shit called Facebook jail. Never happened to me because, like, I don't really go crazy on Facebook, but I know friends that post something that wasn't even all that bad and they get banned on certain things. They get so it's like, you have no freedom of speech. I mean, yeah, I could understand certain things. Like if you're threatening a terror attack or something like that. Yeah, of course I could understand that. But just stupid minor things. Like once someone called someone an asshole or whatever. They're in Facebook jail. So it's like, you have no freedom of speech. There's proof right there. Facebook's friggin' guidelines are the most stupidest guidelines I've ever heard. I mean, it just makes me laugh how pathetic this world really is, you know. But you know what's funny with Facebook? There's a lot of hackers going on where you, sometimes your accounts get hacked or someone's using a copy of your your profile or somebody somebody could have your profile picture pretending you know pretending he's you when it's really not and then some person that he's messing with thinks for example me that I'm the exact one messing with someone he's using my face let's just say you know and then here I am now and I get I get attacked meanwhile it wasn't me you know I'm just being used as a, as a catfish, you know, but that's okay, but if you say stupid things on Facebook, that's not okay, so it's like, it's just this whole fucking world, it's just, it's just a complete friggin' joke, man, it's like, I just, I, you gotta laugh, because if you don't laugh, you're just gonna cry, you know, that's how I look at it as, you gotta just laugh at this pathetic bullshit, you know, live in a world where literally nothing makes sense, rules are all made up, this is the rule now, this rule could change over time, you know, Weed's legal now, or, or cocaine's legal now, you know, I'm just saying, well, weed supposedly <coughs> is going to be legal, legalized, whatever, but, you know, it's like, we just change things around, because we're bored or something, I mean, that's how I look at it as, you know, uh, you gotta be 21 years old to drink, uh, Oh, now it's 18 or, you know, I'm just, you know, saying like, I think for someone to buy a gun here and currently in the United States, you got to be 18 or older, if I'm not mistaken. But now I think they want to, if they want to add it to your 21 or something. So it's like, what's the difference? You know, I mean, just, just a few years more, you know, 18, two, three years more, you got to wait. I mean, it's just. We're stupid. It's like we just, we just, like I said, we just change things up. We just make things up. All right, uh, let's make it this way now. Okay, let's make it that way now. Hmm. Really? Well, all right, change the rules here. No turn on red. Actually, now let's make it allowed. He, you can turn on red. Well, actually, change the plans. No, you know what I mean? It would just switch things up. I know traffic lights, for example, where it said no turn on red, then they made it. Now you could turn on red. So it's like, so it's basically an example of how rules just currently keep changing. It's like nothing makes fucking sense. We just make it all up. It's like a game. It's like a video game. We create rules or whatever the hell. I don't know, man. It's just. 
Oh, I don't know anymore, man. It's just, it's, it's, it's really, really, really just mind blowing how stupid humanity is, how stupid this whole system is. And what's really stupid is how people don't see what a joke life truly is. They don't see what a complete waste of time this is. They take it so seriously. We, they talk shit about us people if we don't want to participate in this type of stuff or if we think this certain way, we're considered negative, depressed when that's not really the case. We just see what a complete big, big joke this whole system, this whole society, this whole world truly is. And it's like we'll look like the, the sick, crazy ones. I don't know. I, mean, I, just, I just laugh because I know deep down we ain't the crazy ones. It's just common fucking sense. I'm not saying I'm a genius. It's just common fucking sense. It shouldn't really take a brain to actually see what a shithole that we're in i mean being forced to go to jury duty being forced to be in a, in a position where you got to choose if this guy's guilty or not guilty i mean doesn't that ring a bell seeing how fucked up this whole system truly is i mean you're just being forced out of your will you know i mean some people like going in a sick way you know and hey like i said if you want to go you should have that right but you should also have that right to not go if you don't want to go person doesn't want to go ask somebody else there's definitely someone in the world that's going to say yes no matter what situation you're always going to get someone in this world that's going to say yes so go to the person that's going to say yes don't force somebody that's going to say no we should all have freedom of rights like they so say we have well i don't fucking see it and we should see it anyway i hope i made my point there tonight love you all guys and yeah sad world we live in guys take it easy